it's been a while. But hey, I got good news. I'm finally leaving Skid Row. I, I'm clean now. Got a van. I'm not sure where we're headed, but we're getting the hell out of here. Hey, I'd really love to see you. Um, call me back. All right. Bye. Andy Roo Roo to jump a kangaroo. Uh, I had a minor setback. The van broke down in Colorado, but I'm gonna check out Denver for a while until I figure out how to fix it. I still really want to see you. I'm not even sure where you are. Um, my phone's all messed up, so I'm not taking it with me, but hopefully I'll catch you instead of, you know, playing phone tag. All right. I love you. Uh, Call me back. Bye. Savage, how are you doing? <laughs> well, I'm doing, Andy Roo How you doing, you kangaroo? 
Ah, my asthma's been acting up, but otherwise today's been pretty decent. Just got out of the shop. What are you up to? Just hanging out. All right. Huh. Are you smoking? Yes. <laughs> okay, well, just, just be careful. You smoke around family homes, you might get towed. I'm being careful. Okay. How's the neighborhood? Well, <laughs> it turns out it's a really shitty neighborhood, Andrew. Okay, well, uh, house friend, what's the dog up to? Curled up on the passenger seat asleep. She's sleeping on the job? She is. She's she's a slack and coal pilot. What a lazy dog. Yeah. What's going on with the van? Tell me about it. Um, there's no power in it right now, but... It uh, got me all the way to Colorado, so can't complain too much. Uh, either way, it sounds a lot safer than living in a tent off a of skid row, right? Mm-hmm. It's bigger. Did you hear back from the doctor yet? Ooh, uh, no, I haven't yet. Do you know how long it usually takes? No, I've never been in that sort of situation. Do you want to talk about what happened? Nope. <laughs> I do not. Okay. Well, I'll be coming to get you in a few days. I don't know quite how long yet, but I'll be there, okay? Okay. Okay. You're going to be good till I get there, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so, like, uh, a few days... Until you leave? Uh, I, I don't know yet. I'll, okay. I'll just let you know. I'll, I'll give you another call, okay? Okay. It'll be nice to see you. Well, it'll be great to see you, too. Yeah. Uh, okay. Okay. Well, yeah. Anyway, I'm on my way to get you, okay? That's all that matters. But, um, okay. I gotta go, all right? All right. Okay. I'll talk to you later. You stay safe, you little hooligan. Okay. Okay, I love you. I love you, too. Okay. 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 What do you want? You're not getting this. You're not getting this. Is this, is this the only thing that will satisfy you right now? What? Look at all this newspaper. You could be on newspaper. You have to go outside? Ain't got no proof, ain't found 
Sorry, Mr. Call. Um, you kind of caught me off guard with the weird, the strange things that are going on. So, just curious about that. Call me back when you get a chance. Thanks. Bye. I think we do need supplies, little doggy. I think we do. <laughs> oh. I don't think anyone's gonna ask you if you got punched. They're just gonna question if you're insane. Which means they won't ask you anything. Friend? Sorry, the fort while I'm gone. You've tried to reach Andrew Bell and are unsuccessful. If you could please leave your name and number, he will get back to you at his earliest convenience. Hey, Andy. You were right. Some weird shit is going on. I, uh, I went to the grocery store and it was packed. Millions of people, but nothing on the shelves. I found some water in the dog food aisle and, you know, you know what happened? Just some really... Shady shit happened. I'd love to tell you all about it if you just answer your fucking phone. Call me back.
Please have your full name and date of birth for verification, please. Hi, uh, my name is Alex Bell. My date of birth is August 9th of 2000. Great, thank you. How may I help you today? Uh, well, my 24-hour gym has uh, closed and they won't answer the phone, so I was hoping to put a stop payment on them, please. Of course, completely understandable. Most of our clients are having trouble with businesses' auto payments due to the government-mandated shutdown and stay-at-home order for quarantine. I can take care of that for you. I will just, however, have to put you on a very brief hold. Oh wait, no, I actually... Oh. Well, no one's there. This message is for Alex Bell regarding blood test results. Please give us a call back at your earliest convenience at 300-549-2656. Hey. We cannot answer the phones right now. If you are feeling sick and worried you have the virus, please self-isolate. If you are having trouble breathing, please come in. Signs and symptoms of the COVID-19 virus may vary. Being elderly or having pre-existing conditions may increase the chance of death. People with asthma, diabetes, heart disease, and men have a higher risk of experiencing the worst of the coronavirus. Please stay home, wash your hands, and stay safe. The mailbox is full and cannot accept any messages at this time. Goodbye. <laughs> hey, buddy. Hey, friend. What you doing? I don't want to smoke. What's in this? Alex? No better time to smoke this than this kind of situation. Alex? Alex? Friend? Are you addicted, Alex? Nothing about any of this has anything to do with addiction. I'm not addicted. I just... I'm just stressed out. And I think... This has always been a really good way to de-stress. Just a lot. So, I'm just stressed. I'm not addicted, I'm stressed. It sounds like something someone who's addicted would say, Alex. Who are you to judge me on anything about addiction? I'll show you addiction. I'm not gonna smoke this little dog. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Come on, Alex. Yay! Yay! Oh my god! Alex? <sighs> hey, buddy. Yeah? Let's distance ourselves from this, okay? We need to take a dump. Let's get some fresh air. Yeah? I'm gonna go for a walk. Fuck yeah, I wanna go for a walk. Let's go outside. Let's go outside. Let's go! We're going on a fucking walk!
Hello, is this Alex Bell? Yes, who's this? This is Dr. McCormick. I'm calling about your blood test results. Oh, uh, anything I need to worry about? No, not that precisely, but uh, congratulations, you're pregnant. What? Oh, shit! Well, there are some other options in case you are looking for uh, maybe not to go through with the pregnancy. Uh, however, I do need to know by next Wednesday, because a month after that, I will be flying back to Holland, and I will not be available for six to eight weeks on a family vacation. Now, we do accept most most forms of health care, health insurance. news wake up little dog you're the only baby no other babies only this far baby <laughs> aren't you excited no Some good news for you. You're not gonna be an uncle. Look, you haven't called me back in a while, and uh, I, uh, I'm just worried about you. I am. Um, <laughs> I can tell you what happened <laughs> if you want to know, but. I think this whole thing has been a fuck up. <laughs> I'm sorry. I shouldn't have been out. I shouldn't have bought this fucking van. <sighs> I'm gonna be okay. I just need to know that you're okay. And then everything will be okay. Call me back, okay? <laughs> Call me back, Andy. Hello? Uh, hello, this is Nurse Lopez. Uh, am I speaking with uh, Alex Bell? Yes. Uh, great. Uh, are you Andrew Bell's sister? He has you listed as an emergency contact. Yeah, I'm his sister. Oh, great. Uh, he has been hospitalized due to complications with asthma. Uh, he's doing okay. In fact, he's due to be discharged. We just need you to come pick him up. Where is he? Uh, he's at the Mid-Michigan Medical Center. I'll be there as soon as I can. Wonderful. Thank you for your time. Thank you. 